Mid-autumn day is called Chusik in Korean. During last weekend's three-day holiday marking the middle of fall on the lunar calendar, a series of folk custom activities were held in the Yanbian Korean Autonomous Prefecture in northeastern Jilin province. Wrestling is one such traditional folk sport event of the Korean people, a combination of power and skill. Wrestlers from all of the city of Yanbian gathered in Folk Square to take part in the competition. Han Yongxun from Yanbian University was one of the stars of the show. There are a lot of competitions to take part in and we can communicate with each other. I feel good because there are a lot of spectators here today. This is my second year taking part in the competition. I'll try my best no matter what happens. The wrestling event was divided into three categories for school boys, middle school students, and adults. The winner of the adult division is awarded a large kettle, a traditional prize in Korean wrestling. Your technique, power, and intelligence are all important to winning. Having only power or good technique is not enough. At the same time, a group of Korean girls in traditional dress were playing on a swing in their ethnic Korean style. Their back and forth swaying gave up a relaxing vibe. The seesaw is another traditional sport for Korean women. Powered by a partner at the opposite end, the girls can jump as high as 10 or 12 feet in the air, and they pull off some eye-catching poses as well. It's really hard to practice, but it's really fun too. As a Chinese Korean, it's my honor to stay in touch with our traditional folk sports. Her honor and spectators' pleasure, who showed up in numbers to take in the festival's unique traditional sports.